Thank you, Heather, and welcome everybody to another edition of the Healthy by Choice Masterclass on Tuesday evenings. And I'm glad you're all here. This is going to be a really uh, uh, good class. We're going to talk about healthy families by choice. But as first, as we usually do, we're going to do a little bit of review. And uh, this is the front page of a, a uh, magazine that Heather and I published some time ago called The Self-Care Awakening. And I think we can all agree uh, we can't put a price on our health. And if we're going to be talking about healthy families, we can't get a price on anybody's health that we know or care about, and, and especially our children. And we're going to address some of that this morning, uh, this evening. So self-care is an active process through which we become aware of and then make choices for a healthier life. And in this class, we talk about the Nikan Wellness Home, the Nikan Active Wellness Products, and how they can allow us all to be healthy by choice and not leave our health to chance. So this statistic isn't one that I think any of us can be proud of. And basically what it's saying is the U.S. leads the world in chronic disease and pharmaceutical consumption. But it's not just a problem that we have here in the U.S. It is a global issue. So if we look at the statistics here, 50% of adults, one out of two of us, have at least one chronic condition. And 33% of us suffer with two or more. And chronic diseases are the leading causes of death and disability worldwide. They're responsible for nearly 70% of deaths, and they're probably most responsible for uh, just poor quality of life. And these are advancing across every region of our globe and pervading all socioeconomic classes. And chronic diseases have interrelated and common risk factors, and they're largely preventable. Yet we spend about 97% on treatment with only 3% invested in self-care or prevention. Now, when we're talking about our kids, this is alarming right here. This was a 2012 Time Magazine cover article, and it's listing all these just chronic diseases that, uh, that we hope our kids don't look forward to in the future, but unfortunately, it's a huge, huge issue. So if we look at this, it's a childhood issue as well. So I'm gonna take some US fig fig figures here. Um, and let's just look, in 1960, less than 2% of kids reported to have health conditions severe enough to interfere with their usually daily activities. In other words, a chronic issue. Uh, currently, the statistics from American Pediatrics from 2017 said at least 54% of American children have a diagnosed chronic condition. And the most common are obesity, asthma, allergies, ADD, ADHD, and autism spectrum disorders. So this, this is another slide that kind of just looks at the prevalence of these problems. So currently, one in three children are overweight, one in six have learning disabilities, one in nine have asthma, one in 10 has ADHD, one in 12 have food allergies, one in 20 have seizures, and one in 54 have autism. So we also talked about these chronic diseases and these issues as having interrelated risk factors. Now, some of these are non-modifiable, and that would be like heredity or age, but chronic diseases are primarily environmental. And back, and for example, not genetic in origin. So we have modifiable factors, which really, um, when we're looking at children's health, I think I have a lot to do with diet, uh, not enough physical activity, but also with those lifestyle choices uh, that we make in our homes, uh, especially as far as diet and some other pretty simple things. So if we look at this and these modifiable factors, uh, they include the following four. Most of us live in a state of chronic dehydration. In other words, we just don't drink enough water. Uh, the average uh, adult sleeps less than seven hours per night. And the average American consumes way too much sugar, about 153 grams of sugar per day. And we all live in a toxic world 
and we sequester these environmental toxins and it's estimated that each of us have more than 200 contaminants in our body. If we look at this from the standpoint of children, 50% of children and teens are dehydrated. And I was quite amazed uh, at this figure to say that 25% of kids don't drink water daily. 60% uh, of our kids don't get enough sleep. They eat way too much processed foods and foods that are spiked with uh, added sugar and consuming way too much sugar. And at the same time, uh, they carry environmental toxins too. And we may even have to up that figure from 200 to close to 300. This is a study by the Environmental Working Group uh, in 2005, where they tested the umbilical cord blood of newborn infants and detected nearly 300 environmental toxins. And of these, 180 caused cancer, 217 were toxic to the brain and nervous system, and 208 can cause birth defects or abnormal development. Um, and not good. So this is, this is a quote from Harry S. Truman. And it reads, in the long view, no nation is any healthier than its children. And I would have to wholeheartedly agree with that. So what we can do, we can do some pretty simple things. So let's talk about that. And again, in the context of these interrelated risk factors. So we want our children to be hydrated and we wanna be hydrated ourselves. And within these things, what I'm talking about is we wanna set the models uh, because our children will model us. And uh, I talked about that in the impetus in last week's uh, blog uh, and just creating that healthy lifestyle. So stay hydrated, make sure your children are hydrated. And uh, we need to also make sure we get enough sleep. So we need to get at least eight hours of sleep each night and kids need nine to 12 hours depending on their age. We wanna make food choices and help our kids reduce that sugar consumption and ourselves to 25 grams a day for women and children, and 36 grams a day for men, which is about six teaspoons a day for women and kids and about nine teaspoons a day for men. And while we're doing this, while we're staying hydrated, we're getting enough sleep and taking some good healthy food uh, and nutritionals that will help our bodies uh, reduce that body burden of environmental toxins. So within this, we talk about the solution being the Nikon Wellness Home. And it is a great prevention method. It really is self-care. So Nikon Active Wellness products use science and technology to replicate nature so that we can all be healthy by choice and not leave our health to chance. So it's like a greenhouse for humans. And um, when I get Karen on, we'll talk about this a little bit more, but it's, it's uh, basically to where these choices are very simple. And for example, within the wellness home, we, we uh, concern ourselves with having healthy air. Uh, we have healthy water to drink on a daily basis and enough of it. Uh, get good night's sleep, uh, have some healthy whole food nutrition and some healthy natural energies to give us a little more energy. And we convey this in the wellness home through what we call our wellness home packs. Now, I think the main advantage here is that the, the wellness home makes these choices very simple. And we'll talk about that a little bit more. But we can have healthy water with the water pack, and we can also bathe in healthy water with our, with our microjet shower system. And we can have that on the go with my Pimax sport bottle or with the waterfall at home, which is our home unit. We can get a great night's sleep with the Nikon sleep system. Uh, we can have great fresh air, clean, healthy air with the Kinko air purifier in our home, which is very important because it's estimated that the air inside our homes is about five times worse than it is outside, even, the most, even in the most polluted industrial cities. Uh, we can provide some energy uh, and some relief from discomfort and some uh, natural energies for our body to help take care of itself. And we have core nutrition, uh, organic, wholesome, whole food nutrition to help make these choices very simple and very easy. So we each have about 10 trillion cells in our body and we need to replace 6 billion of those each day. And that seems like a daunting task, um, but to kind of put it in perspective, 6 billion a day, um, just in the time I said that, uh, our bodies replace 50 million cells. 
but they need the right tools to do that. So I, I have around the cell just about everything as a physiologist that I can think of, and I've shown this to many other uh, professionals in my field and in the medical field. And I don't think there's much else we could add to that, but uh, as, as such as air and sleep and antioxidant support, uh, clean, healthy water. But our cells need these things so they, they can divide and replicate and renew themselves. So here is the Nikan product or technology associated with those needs from the previous slide. So this is, in my opinion, by design. It's not by accident, and it's really where the power of the wellness home comes in. So again, it's with these packs that, uh, that we convey that. And, and with that, I'm going to ask Heather to open up uh, our guest tonight, which is Karen Messersmith. And Karen is a physical therapist, a very good friend of mine, and we work very closely to help others be healthy by choice. So Karen, thank you for joining us. Sure. Um, thank you, Gary. Gary asked me to be on the call to kind of share my experience with the Neekin Wellness Home. Um, I got introduced to Neekin about 20 years ago. I was actually on maternity leave up in our cabin in the Redwoods, and someone came up and offered to give me a magnetic massage, and I said, yes, definitely. And afterwards, um, he had me stand on our magnetic insoles, and I felt tingling go from my feet up to my waist, and it really caught my attention. I kind of wanted to know more. Um, I just, as a physical therapist, people had asked me about magnets, and I said, you know, if it, if it feels good, do it. I knew nothing. So they came and did a presentation in my house um, with a bunch of my physical therapist buddies and uh, kind of put products around, and someone put this necklace on me, and my shoulders dropped. And I said, I'm in. I said, I need these products to help my own health, help others. Little did I know the impact it would have on my family. About a year later, um, well we, after that, we invested in our wellness home. So we invested in air systems, water systems, sleep strategy, our product line, and just started living because I had the prevention end of it, and so did my husband. So about a year later, my son got diagnosed with a kid's hip disease, and I started working on him every night with some of our technology, and I'd move his hip. And it didn't move, and it didn't. Move. And about a half hour later, it moved a lot more, and it felt a lot better. And we did this for months. He was four years old, and he was learning how to read. So this started a ritual. Um, was also sleeping in a sleep system, drinking the water, and at the time we had little kid magnetic insoles, so he had those in his shoes. And it really um, the disease that he had kind of resets itself, and he can. Nikon's products kind of put Ryan in that, what Gary explained, that greenhouse effect. So his body could do truly what it was supposed to do, and that was to heal. And fast forward a couple years, um, he was already entering back to sport. The orthopedic doctor said, you're already doing stuff, we'll lead him to full duty and our full sports. And he went on to play all the way through high school and college. He has been a very, very much an athlete all the way through. And I know that greenhouse effect of that wellness home enabled him to do that. A lot of kids with that disease don't walk or run right, let alone play sports. Um, I had a similar but different experience. I too had a, a little challenge going on and I was a runner and I always could run and was active in sports all my life and then I couldn't. And I started using more products and doing different things and Nikan got me back to sport also. I started back running. I started doing triathlons. I actually, four years ago, did a full Ironman for my 50th birthday, took on that challenge, and started um, also doing marathons. So hopefully Chicago will open up by October, and I will be running my 10th marathon at the Chicago Marathon. So Nikan gave both me and my son the gift of being athletes again, but just being back to health. Um, we invested in our wellness home as a prevention tool for our family at one point all four of us, we're doing triathlon together. We have a fifth wheel trailer and most people have ATVs and motorcycles in the back of theirs. We had bicycles. We traveled all over doing um, triathlon as a family with our Nikan beds and our Nikan water and our Nikan air, truly preparing us before races and allowing our bodies to recover after races. Um, that prevention factor was true all the way through when the kids grew up. 
um, next door, I remember there was the flu, the flu, the flu, like five times over just next door. And we kind of said, what flu? My kids didn't get sick growing up. We didn't get sick growing up. If they felt bad, we just wrap them in a neck and comforter. And by the, you know, a couple hours later, they were feeling fine. So that prevention tool, you know, we don't, we don't think about getting sick. It just, you know, we are living in kind of our wellness home. Um, and being a physical therapist, it's great to have had Nikin and still do um, being able to share products. You know, I might work on someone's ankle, but now I have an insole that can go in and help the energy of that ankle feel better and continue to make them feel better as they walk and run and do their job or their sport. Um, you know, our, our sleep system, I call it the recovery tool. Any athlete that I can talk to or anybody that, that wants to recover from being sore or doing whatever they're doing, that's what our, you know, we have a cocoon of energy that enables the body to heal and restore at night. Um, even, you know, I had, I had my 94-year-old grandma using a mag boy, you know, before she had passed away years ago. My mom and dad used the products. My mom said, hey, can I have an extra back magnet? Because I don't want to go without mine. Uh, my mother-in-law recently had a challenge, and she pulled out all these mag um, magnets and wraps and all kinds of stuff to help her through what she was going through. So it's great, you know, it, I love to help people, but I love to empower people. So our Neek and Wellness Home is truly a situation where we can empower people to take care of their own health. And you know, I have, I've had four-legged friends and family members. Um, I have a, right next to me, a Neek and pet pad. Um, I'm working from home now and my dog is usually laying on the pad next to me. Um, she's getting older, she just turned 11 last week and she will seek out where the pad is and or our bed to kind of restore her body because they know the energy. They know how it works. So I can't say it enough about my Nick and Wellness Home. We're still using products that we invested in 20 years ago. And you can't say much about that with other things. And they're still benefiting us. So um, I wear products all day long. I wear my, my bracelet, my necklace, and my back magnet, my earrings, and my insoles. And I'm up working on people. So I feel... You know, yesterday, I ran 10 miles in the Redwoods. I'm not even sore today, but I, I use the products. So I must say this little, uh, we call it a mag duo. It used to be a little mag boy. This is my family's little first aid kit. My kids grew up with this in their sports bag. I usually have this in my purse or my bag or my car at all times, and I just roll something that hurts. We call it the eraser. So I can run, run energy through it, and it helps. So I can't say enough. I think I covered mostly everything, Gary. <laughs> Did I miss anything? <laughs> I, no, but I could listen to you all night. I really could. So, <laughs> well, that's you. awesome. So, so let's just chat about this for a minute because it, obviously being active in sports yourself really and your healthy lifestyle influence your children's lifestyle as well. And, and, and I can say the same. I mean, my kids pretty much grew up in a wellness home and when they went to college, uh, they ended up in a uh, wellness dorm room. I mean, they had the water. I, I forgot that part. Mine too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and and they continue to utilize our products, technologies, and also apply uh, common sense prevention, uh, you know, tactics in their lives. So uh, I, I think that's extremely, extremely powerful. So. Yep. <laughs> and and their children will too. You know. So. Yes. So we are a global wellness community living in harmony with nature. And what we kind of mean by that is uh, we have lots of products, but Nikon really uh, takes the time and does the due diligence to uh, source organic and uh, certified organic, especially for our nutritional products. Our packagings are, are biodegradable. You know, the, the plastic we use in our water products, some of our other products are recyclable and, and biodegradable as well. So. Um, we, we really, uh, it, it's really just providing our body with the things nature intended, uh, so it can heal itself. Would you agree, Karen? Yes, definitely. Definitely. Yeah. So, so, you know, we kind of invite you to join our global wellness community and to do that, get back to the person that invited you on this evening's class. Uh, they can give you a couple options so you can start your wellness home. And uh, if you have some uh, interest in some of the other subjects that we've talked about in the class, uh, Heather and I have a YouTube channel, the Self-Care Awakening YouTube channel, 
where you can take a look at uh, specific areas that we talk about through self-care. And then we will resume uh, classes on June 9th, uh, which we'll be talking about the new product. So uh, it's pretty exciting. And it, I'll just give you a little hint. Uh, when we're talking about healthy families and you know people that have a passion for healthy families, this is definitely a product launch you want to attend. So that's uh, just a little hint there. That's all I can say. So with that, I'm going to stop the share and we can do some.